Hey guys, it's Greg and it's Friday and we're going to continue to go through the drop for the week. And we had a lot of stuff from our friends at GRP in Tuscany, in Italy. Those are, <clears throat> GRP is uh, basically a knit knitting company and um, they have a tendency to do stuff that tends to be a little bit like more of a vintage vibe to them. And we really love what they do for the summer, which is a lot of linen and also some cotton knits. Um, a lot of restocks, 19 restocks, and then five new styles for this drop. Let's start with this side while well, we're at it. Those are knit tees in 100% linen. And we're gonna bring this one here. Um, they are short sleeve knit tees, all for them. Uh, some uh, solid colors in natural, in green, and in gray. And then we have the uh, striped colors in uh, brown and uh, natural. And then this new color with a little bit of a rolled neck, a little bit tunic-like in blue and white. That's a new one. Then we've got the Henleys, which are a little bit of the same, except of course they have a Henley uh, neck. And also they have that kind of like rolled edge uh, pocket, whereas those do not have any pockets. we got the natural, same as this guy. We have this military green, which is not the same as that. And it's really, really beautiful oil color, which is a bit of a petrol blue between blue and green. Still in linen, we've got polos. One that's short sleeve and four that are long sleeve. The one that's short sleeve is that kind of like skipper style, no button placket, a little bit of that rolled edge again. And it is blue stripe with the navy or the, the blue edges. And then we've got four colors of our really classic long sleeve linen polo and that's something you can wear even with tailoring under a jacket it's really really nice evening out in the summer very comfortable so we got the burgundy uh this is uh what they call blue we call it navy very dark navy we've got this ochre color that's really nice for the season and then again uh the dark green now moving on to uh cotton knits We've got five of what seems to be really a crowd favorite, which is the bubble knit uh, cotton polo. It's very, very cool because of the bubble. It really stands away from the skin. It's very, very cool wearing. Uh, and also there's something about the knitting itself that's quite open, as you can probably see through the lens. So we've got the four colors that we're restocking from previous season, which this one is a petrol blue, the ecru, which is the best seller, uh, the uh, mustard, which we love, this kind of tobacco, ochre brown. And then the new color is this uh, gray, charcoal gray, so dark gray. Uh, finally, we've got some uh, slightly more complex uh, polo shirts uh, the, that we started last uh, spring, summer. It was a massive success. Is that diamond uh, retro uh, jacquard, I mean, not jacquard, it's, a, it's the pattern of the knitting. Uh, we've got the blue on blue here that we had last year. That's a really, really well. We've got the kind of like tobacco or orange and blue on a cream background. And then the new uh, color for this season is this uh, kind of orange and uh, indigo on that navy uh, background. Uh, those are all uh, short sleeves. And now we have two new styles of short sleeve, also 100% cotton with very different type of pattern. Um, but also with a button placket, also a short sleeve. But this is like a really, really, really gauzy, almost like very light wearing, crisp, uh, tiny, tiny diamond pattern on the knit. Uh, it's something that's again like a little bit retro, but very, very easy to wear uh, anytime you want. You can wear that under tailoring, you can wear it on, on, on its own, you can go to the beach with it. It's cotton, it's easy to maintain. Uh, we've got navy and we've got the ecru. That's it for GRP. Now we're gonna talk about some additional drops from um, Portuguese Final and the Bonfactura, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the last we've got going on. And Portuguese Final, you might've seen this tease on our IG earlier this year. It is an absolute banger. It's what they're calling the grandma knit shirt. Um, and it's not exactly a grandma knit. It's very, uh, you know, less conservative than that. Kind of a little a little sexy, a little uh, nice and sultry. You kind of wear this a little bit buttoned open, really nice open uh, knit going on with this. You've seen us have very similar from other makers, but this is how Portuguese flannel uh, went ahead and did it. Uh, they have this 
cotton lining that you'll see throughout it. So while that open knit might be a bit daunting for guys that don't really want to expose too much skin, you can uh, go ahead and be secure knowing that that's going to be covered up. But for the real ones that just want that breeze to come through, I would honestly just snip that out. Take it to a tailor, take it, get some scissors, do it yourself. Just keep it nice, loose, keep it fresh. It's summer. Just You're okay. Let it breathe. You get two shirts. Two shirts. You can actually probably cut it out, have your own poplin shirt. That's we'll charge you the same price, but you get that's nice. The next stuff we've got uh this washed cupro uh in this really like nice subtle uh like tonal stripe going on. You can kind of see the how the colors kind of like dance in the in the light, just the way that the washed of that cupro works. And while it's already iridescent, the wash makes it really pleasing. Soft to the touch, um, same shape as the others. You know this camp collar shirt for Jimmy Swannel is great. And the last of the shirts is a restock, a favorite. This is the um, button-down collar uh, chambray shirt from Portuguese Flannel. Uh, we have the matching shorts. So if you wanted to make a whole like matching summer setup, you can go ahead and put this on, but it also just works as you'd expect a chambray shirt too. Uh, like, uh, unlike a lot of Portuguese Flannel shirts, they're usually more relaxed. This is a bit slimmer cut. So we would recommend sizing up even if you want, just like a regular fit. Um, but otherwise, yeah, great shirt, big fan of these. And then lastly from Portuguese Flannel, Another style that you've seen before, the Labora Chore Coat, but this fabrication is none that we've ever seen before. Uh, from afar, you can kind of see this like uh, very textured, almost like like ridges of like mountains, the way this uh, jacquard is, but it, it's really spongy in hand. It's not like crisp as you'd expect. It's not as crunchy. It feels uh, and handles almost like a cardigan. And uh, it kind of leans into that with having like a buttonless cuff and, um, and yeah, just the way that it kind of feels, the way that it interacts when you put your pockets in there. Uh, when you put your hands in the pocket, it really just kind of like sags very comfortably the way you expect a cardigan to. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be the times when you're like chilling in the like AC for this uh, spring. Cause I can definitely see this swing for fall, especially in this nice, very fall colored uh, green right here. So two colors, both really strong. And that is Portuguese flannel. And then lastly, we have De Bon Factor, our friends out in France, we have Another knit polo. I know you guys have probably seen all these knit polos. You saw a bunch from GRP. This one's a bit different. This one has a really nice open, like a lofty knit to it. It almost feels like there's like layers of knit going on here. It's what they call honeycomb knit. Um, and you can see it compared to like the standard rib knit that you see in the hem. It's a really nice contrast. This is a lot more thin. This is a lot more beefy, um, but they both feel really nice on skin. The cut is relaxed. Um, and it's a fun shape, the way that like the sleeves are a bit elongated and the body is a bit cropped. So it all kind of maintains this like really, really fun play in proportions. It's modeled after like a vintage find that they found up there in France. And yeah, it's really neat, finished with their classic DBF, foreign buttons. And then lastly is another restock from DBF. This is the painter's jacket. We have this in oatmeal that we had earlier this season um, and still up hopefully. Uh, unless y'all bought it up, it's a really nice jacket. But now we have it in their classic Arabica linen, which is this like in-between color of like a deep uh, olivey brown gray color. Um, same details as before, as you'd expect, short coat pocket layout, button cuffs and button front. Uh, it's in a Belgian linen that's a little bit more substantial than like lighter linen. So you can wear it as a jacket, but you can still wear it as a shirt. It still wears nice, soft and smooth on body. And yeah, that is the end of the Friday drops. Make sure to watch the other video. We have a new brand out there, Paratodo, dropping this week. Um, and you can see the pants I'm wearing right here. Look how sick these are, very nice pants. Uh, but other than that, we'll see you all next week for the next drop.